Hi, Ryan here from Evolve Tennis Academy, bringing you another three quick tips for all the single-handed backhanders out there. Let's start with our grip. We need to get into an eastern grip for our single-handers. That's going to be done by getting your index finger top knuckle onto bevel number one, so your top bevel there. You'll notice I haven't got my fingers bunched together. That will only just take away a little bit of pace, so I want to make sure that I'm spread apart. And once again, my index finger knuckle is up on bevel number one. Tip number two, keeping spatial awareness when playing the shot. Making sure that I'm coming through and having a full extension of my hitting arm. We don't want to be bunched in here, okay? So when I'm playing that shot, make sure that there is a nice distance between the racket head and my body. Tip number three, single-handed backhand. Make sure we have kept balance throughout the shot. This will be done by making sure my left hand and my right hand separate through contact. My grip, making sure I'm going to have that spatial awareness, but also you'll notice that left hand going backwards to the back fence. So my hand separating, keeping balance, that'll allow my racket head to go through the ball as opposed to pulling off the ball. So once again, make sure those hands are separating in opposite directions. Three quick tips for all the double-handed backhanders out there. Let's start with the grip. I'm needing to get into a continental grip with a semi-western on my top hand. So my non-dominant hand will be around towards a semi-western. Tip number two, making sure that our racket is staying on our left hand side, similar to our forehand last week. So if I'm taking that racket back, I wanna make sure that I can see the racket on this side. I don't wanna be pulling around and hiding the frame behind my body. Tip number three, and always a good one that people forget about. Make sure your non-dominant hand, for me, my left hand, is doing the majority of the work, around 70% throughout the shot. So that, once again, is your top hand doing about 70% of the work. Well, I hope you've enjoyed those quick tips on your backhand. We'll be sending you some more during the coming weeks, so please stay tuned to your email. And don't forget, we're still open for one-on-one -on -one court hire, so visit our website, you'll be able to book at any one of our locations. Or if you'd like some one-on-one -on -one coaching, simply SMS the number below. Stay safe and see you all soon.